Kiwi. 102.2 Auckland. The Radio Waymo Breakfast. Kiwi. Joining me now in the Kiwi studio from Farmer Pimp, we've got um, Claire this morning. Hello to you, Claire. Morning. Nice to, uh, nice to have you in. Good to see you. Thanks for having me. And on the line uh, this morning, we have uh, Mark from Farmer Pimp. Hello to you, Mark. Morning, guys. Morning. Good morning. Gosh, it's um, so nice to have everyone connected this morning and oh. talking about... <laughs> technology. Technology and talking about your brand new um, brand new CD, which is um, just being released. Is it, is it out today? Is today release day? No, out Monday, actually. Okay. Yeah. Um, but tonight is the release gig. Tonight's a little sneak preview. Yeah. Indeed. Mark, a long time coming. It has been a little while coming. Yeah, a little. I mean, um, we've just been really, really focused and made sure that we've done as good a job as we can and that we're really passionate and happy about it the whole way and kind of forgot about everything else. So, uh, yeah, before we knew it, it's, uh, a couple of years had passed. But, yeah, we've got something we're pretty, pretty damn stoked on. Because thinking about um, your first kind of release to, to radio, what, what year was that, Claire? Um, our EP came out in 2006. Um, but I but I remember Farmer Pimp stuff oh, being, being, yeah. being played sort of 2001 or 2002 or something. No, no we no. kind of met all like 2004 was when we met. Oh, okay. And we right. pretty much like straight away just started sneaking stuff out to radio. Yeah. So, um, but the good good thing was our first kind of proper release, I guess. Um, was 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 06. Yeah, 06. Yeah. Yeah. Wasn't well, that still? I mean, what, we're talking six years. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, six, what, what year is it? Two thousand eleven. Yeah. Wow. Well, almost. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You just got got this out in time for the Rugby World Cup. Is that what you've done? That's yes. What it's it was about. all about yeah. that. Yeah, because <laughs> some somewhere buried in the CD is a theme tune. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe for Mozambique or something. <laughs> <laughs> um. Uh, I've noticed also in the city that um, that some of the stuff that, or at least one of the tracks that would have been familiar to um, to you guys uh, or to, to to listeners of Farmer in the past has been re-recorded. Has some of the stuff been reworked? Uh, that was just the one track, I think, um, mm. El Roboto. Yeah. So that was kind of uh, that was something that we was a work in progress and. I kind of uh, gave it to a friend at BFM, and before I know it, and a couple of people before I know it, it was uh, getting played on the radio, which was uh, which was cool, but uh, slightly premature because it was really just a work in progress. But again, that's kind of been the history of Farm Hip Hip. We kind of work on things in our studio and then pass them on to a couple of champions and cool mates out in the industry, and before we know it, it's getting a bit of earplay. So yeah, um, yeah it was just that one song, and that's how that one that one happened. But we were kind of we were kind of only about 50-60% through until we uh, yeah, got to this final point. Well, it's just, I guess that's the freedom of being independent, I suppose. Now, if you were tied into some kind of record label and contract, that you'd, you'd be breaching something. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's kind of why we could take our time, I guess. It's like we released through our own label and we recorded at Mark's studio, so um, there was no kind of money or time constraints, just our own sanity, really. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, fully. And did you say Mark Studio? Yeah, Home Studio. Yeah. Home Studio, Mark. What's your set up there? Uh, I've actually just moved out to my um, to Piha, uh, so I've got a set up out here, which I'm just, um, just building at the moment. So I've got a, a control room and a separate uh, studio for recording and tracking and the like. So um, yeah, running running Cubase. What are we up to? Five. I believe. Yeah, it's, and, like, it's uh, a, a, you and you and Neil Finn. Me and Neil Finn, yeah. <laughs> well, you know, and uh, who else is out here? Serge Tank. Tankin, yeah, that's right. The, uh, yeah. Of System of a Down. Yeah. Yeah, we all hang out together at the local RSA. You know, <laughs> exchange musical ideas. Yeah. He, he's guesting on our next song. Yeah. Swap, <laughs> swap knitting patterns and. Yeah. <laughs> Well, it's nice. It's certainly a, a, a wonderful part of the country um, to, to be inspired and, and record music, that's for sure. Yeah, no, it's really lush, huh? Um, I grew up out this way, so I've been wanting to be out here for a while. So um, we had a farmer pimp practice here last week, which was really lush. And, um, yeah, looking forward to some cool sessions out here. And, again, for us, just making sure we enjoy the process, you know, and um, it's not just about the end result. It's trying to make sure, and it can be a challenge at times, but uh, we're getting better at, yeah, just making sure that, we're digging what we're doing while we're doing it. Mm. Now, um, the how, how big is I mean is the, is the core membership of the band? We've got, um, I guess, right at the core, it's just the four of us: um, me, Mark, and JP on keys, and Glenn on drums. Um, and then usually live, we always kind of beef it up. So we've got three horn players, 
Um, but actually for tonight, we're going to have a full string quartet as well. Oh, so lovely. It's going to be 11 of us tonight, yeah. How, how, does a, how does the string quartet come about? I mean, are there, are there, are there, are there string quartets out there for hire? Um, they are, are they? actually, yeah. yeah right. <laughs> these are friends of ours. We're, like guns um, for hire. Yeah. <laughs> Auckland, uh, Auckland's a pretty small place and we know lots of people. So yeah, we've got some, some great friends that um, actually have got an amazing quartet. Um, it's a little bit different than the usual one, but we've got uh, Mahuia, Bridgman Cooper and Jess Hendon and... Um, Rachel Wells, and also you've got your cousin. My cousin, playing. yeah, my cousin. I'm keeping it in the family. Oh, great! So, the very musical, um, musical friends that you need to, um, in order to be able to uh, perform. Definitely, like that. yeah. That's yep. what it's all about: getting your mates involved. So, indeed, so we can pay them an M and M. What What is the name of the album? Sweet Hot Pepper Pop. And is is uh, does that kind of aptly describe? What's contained within? Do you think? I think so, um, because it's you know it's it's really hard coming up with one word or one genre or something that kind of encompasses us. So I think Sweet Hot Pepper Pop kind of um, kind of does it justice. I think. What do you reckon, Wemo? Absolutely. Oh yeah. <laughs> Close. Um, I was uh, what was I doing? I was cooking dinner last night to the to the CD. Oh, nice. And nice. Uh, you know, <laughs> was it a good dinner? Yeah, yeah. It w- was really good. That's how you can judge the music. <laughs> yeah. Those were the tastiest pork chops. <laughs> Oh, ever made. Oh, good. You guys aren't vegetarians, are you? No. No. You'd be offended if people were cooking up meat to your. <laughs> I'm Jewish, though. I'm very offended. <laughs> well, brilliant stuff. It's so good to um, finally have a long player out from you guys and uh, one that people can take away and enjoy um, and cook whatever yeah, delicious meals too. they Definitely. want. Pie. Yeah. Hot, what, hot pepper pie? Uh, music to cook pork pie. Pork pie. Pork pie. Pork pie. <laughs> <laughs> pork pie. <laughs> <laughs> Four pie, <laughs> indeed. Uh, and so tonight, are you going to guys going to take it on the road? We are, yeah. Um, we're probably looking at June um, for a bit of a tour. Because there'll be people all over the country be keen to catch you guys. Oh, yeah, yeah, we yeah, can't we, we wait. Eh? To yeah. Um, tonight in Auckland City at. Um, at 4.20. That's 4.20. all open to everyone, isn't it? It is. It's um, 373K Road, I think. Um, and But come kind of early because um, it's not going to be a really late one. So um, Katie Scott is doing support and she's on around 9 and then we'll be on probably around 10. Excellent. Civilised affair. Very civilised, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mark from Farmer Pimp. Thank you so much. Hey, thank you. Thank you, Wemo. Thanks for all your support, bro. Hey. Kiwi's been a big part of helping us get to this point and Know that we've got a supporter to play it and, and dig it, which is, is means a lot, bro. So easy, cheer, cheer. easy to support when you love it. Oh, cheer. <laughs> oh, warm fuzzies on the wireless. <laughs> I'm hugging myself. Claire from Farmer Pimp, thanks so much as well. Thanks for having me. I'm going to play one of my favourites. This is uh, Like No One Else.